Okay, so hey guys, what is up? This is Turtwig TV here, and I'm coming at you with the first part of my Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke Let's Play. Now, this could go completely horribly wrong because I am no good at Nuzlocke's, so this could be quite humorous. <laughs> humorous? Humorous. But before we start, I gotta give a big shout out to the Titos Station. He has been providing me with all my graphics designs lately since I've been starting up, and he provided the border for this video. His links will be in the description, and in honor of him, I will be naming my starter of this game after him. Okay, so here we go. And the internal. Uh, it doesn't matter, the game still works. Okay, so we start straight away here, and we see Professor Birch come out of the shadows and start to talk us about the basic introduction he gives us about Pokemon in every game. So here we go, and yep. And so yeah, and just continues to talk. And are you a boy or a girl? I am a boy, so I will be naming myself Turtwig. Um, uh, T was T Wig. Um, there we go. So Turtwig, and so it's Turtwig. Yes. Uh, okay. The Turtwig is moving to my hometown of Litterwood. I get it now. You do get it. Okay. So just talks about about the unfolding adventure that is going to be happening here. So, well, yeah. Okay, so we are just chilling in the back of this moving van as it comes. I've, the amount of times I've played through this game, I've always thought, why is our mum just leaving us in the back of a um, in a moving van? I don't know. Why doesn't she just allow us to sit up front with the driver? And then she proceeds to patronise us about it. I must be tiring riding with the things in the moving truck. Why couldn't she get give us a lift here or make us sit, allow us to sit in the front? It's, I don't get why. But okay. So we're just going to talk about our room, so we're just going to go upstairs now quickly. And I'm firstly I'm going to go over to the PC box and withdraw the potion that is left in there. I'm sorry if I know too much about this game, I've played it so many times. Because it is personally, in my opinion, one of the best Pokemon games ever made. Just the story, I just love it so much, even though it's dark, the goals of Team Agro and Mac. Agua, Aqua and Mac Magma, it's still a good game. So I'm going to set it to the time that is here in England, where I've just gone miles past, and again, it's um, 20 to 6, so I'll just set it to that now. And there we go, and the, our mum comes upstairs. So the question of the day is, um, well, since I was talking about how much this is my favourite game, because I must have, on my Pokemon Emerald cartridge, I must have um, put so many hours into it. And this was the game where I caught my first ever shiny. So it's it's got a place dear in my heart. I caught my first ever shiny in that new Marvel, I think it is, where um, you go in and it was a Magnemite, and I have that same Magna Zone on my Pokemon X and Y now. So it's been it's been with me for a long time that Magna Zone, and I use it for my competitive battling. It was one of the things that spurred me off to start um, collecting shinies, which I do now. So yeah. That's why I've been giving, doing a giveaway of my shiny, one of my shiny torchic, well, my shiny, well, the shiny torchic I, ble I bred a couple of days ago, and everything. So now we're just talking to May's mum, or Professor Birch's wife, as we go into um, uh, the thing, and let's just go, and just chill, walk straight into a girl's bedroom and just grab a Pokeball, obviously, because we're that cool. <laughs> she can't stop us. So she's just talking to us about how we're supposed to be friends and how she has to ha help her dad catch Pokemon, but yet she still goes on her computer. I don't know why. <laughs> actually, yeah, that's a thought, thought actually. What is May's... Is, is that May's brother or sister? I can't really tell. 
Yeah. <laughs> you can't really tell from the sprites on this game sometimes. So now we're going to walk up here and... Um, hi, there's some scary Pokemon and I can hear the noises. I don't... I want to see what's going on, but I don't have any Pokemon. Can you see what's happening for me? Of course, little girl, I'll go out and see. Help me. So here's Professor Birch being chased by a Zizagoon. And help me in the bag, there's a Pokeball. And I'm gonna hope, I'm hoping to god there's a grass type. I really do love grass type Pokemon. But I also hope there's a dragon because this game would be so much easier if I get a dragon type as a starter, I'm not gonna lie. Ooh, Shell gone. Ooh, the only thing that can beat that is grass type and it's an Az. Ooh. But I do like Azumarill. Ah, oh, no, I'm gonna have to go with Shell gone, I'm sorry. He is, he is so, so, so cool. He's, he's the one with. Salamence was probably my favourite dragon type, well, it was pretty much just that and Dragonite in this game when it came out, and I had to get a Salamence, so the moves are randomised as well, and all of the wild Pokemon are, so this Shellgon is running of Water Pulse, Dragon Claw, Dizzy Punch, and Leech Life, so I'm just going to go straight for the Stab Dragon Claw with the Shellgon, and hope I can take out this Beedrill in one hit. Ooh, the Beedrill just about lives, I think that's probably 1, P one HP, and, uh, um, Beedrill goes straight for the Mega Punch, so I'm just going to hit it with another Dragon Claw there and take it out. Okay, so, oh yeah, there we go, so Professor Birch, woof, so I was in a tall grass studying wild Pokemon when I was jumped, you saved me, thanks a lot. Oh, you're Turtwig, this, must, this is not the place to chat, so come by my Poke Lab later. Okay, so we just appear in his Pokemon Lab, no, no walking back or anything, so now he's just telling us about how we have our father's blood. And he's telling us how well we, well, I guess you have your father's blood in your veins after all. So, okay, thank you for rescuing me. You don't have any Pokemon. You used it, uh, yeah. Okay, so, you just, well, and then he gives him his shell gun, pretty much. This is a long story short. And then let's give it a nickname. So, to honor the, the legend that's just been providing me with um, graphics, it's been T. Um, uh, it's just lowercase. Titos. And uh, Titos, I owe you so much for the amount of graphic design you've done for me. I'm hopeless with it. But you should check out his Twitter and his YouTube in the description. He is a really nice guy, and well, yeah. And now he, Professor Birch is just asking us to go and see May. So we're just going to walk out. And I'm going to end the episode here, walking out of uh, Professor Birch's lab on the way up to see May and battle our rival for the first time. I hope you enjoyed, and don't forget to answer the comment, qu well, the question of the video in the dis in the comments below. What is your favourite Pokemon game? Because mine personally is this game here, Pokemon Emerald. It's just provided so many great memories for me and everything. So I hope you enjoyed the video, guys, and Turtwig out. <laughs>